Hey, what's going on everyone? NECA here. Hope you all having a wonderful day today so far. I know I am. And today, as you guys can see from the background and from the title of this video, we're back on the fan favorite game, boys. I know how much you guys love your MW2, IW4X trick shotting, so we're back at it today. Normally when I'm uploading this game though, I'll just upload like a stream highlights or a normal trick shotting video. So today I decided to switch it up and I actually got something different for you guys. I mean it's not that different. We're gonna be trick shotting as always, but I'm gonna do something that I haven't really seen done too much on IW4X. It was definitely more of a console MW2 thing. Now you're probably wondering, what's he talking about? And my answer for you guys is today I'm gonna be trick shotting in third person on IW4X. Unfortunately, I actually don't know how to play in third person in online or well the SNR servers. I mean I'm pretty sure you can or at least used to be able to because I have seen a third person shot before on 4X from my teammate Parallel Potter, by the way. So shout out to Potter. But since I couldn't figure that out, I'm actually gonna be hopping into a private match today and try to hit a few shots for you guys in third person on bots. If you guys enjoy this different type of video, please make sure to let me know by dropping a like rating on the video and also dropping a comment in the comment section below. Let me know if you want to see more. Also in the comments, let me know what your favorite shot from today's video was because I plan on at least hitting a few for you guys. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into the IW4X third person trick shotting action. Hopefully you guys enjoy. All right, boys, let's load up the mod real quick. The good old Serpentine 1.6. Shout out to Foxes once again for this menu. And here we are in private match or public match, whatever we want to play, but we will be doing private match today. And I think we're going to start off on... You know, I'm kind of feeling a plane shot, so we're actually going to do terminal. Right, and then for rules, I want to do unlimited round length, unlimited score limit, and third person on. Okay, boys, let's get into a game. Private match time. I haven't played third person in probably like uh, four plus years at this point, so let's see what this looks like. And here we are. I mean, I knew what it looked like, but I haven't played in or played on it in a little while, so I kind of forgot what it felt like. Alright, so I said I wanted to go for a plane shot, so I'm going to spawn in a bot and put him right on these boxes right down here. Save to crosshairs. There we go. And now I'm going to teleport or go to UFO and fly right up here. Oh my god, that looked funny. I'm going to save my position right here. So then when I jump off, let's say I don't hit my shot or whatever, I can just teleport right back up here. I got a bunch of attempts at it then. I could just do this in TDM, but I would have to actually like get to last. I don't think this mod menu has any like fast last for TDM. Nah, it doesn't. And this way I don't have to use tactical insertions either. But basically the shot I'm going for is actually a shot that you can only do in third person. Well, just for the first game. But if you look like when I normally scope in with a normal class, it just like scopes in like normal. But if you put on ACOG, it actually just does like this little plus in the middle of your screen and you can actually like see your gun and still see yourself in third person. And the cool part about that is you can actually like change the posture of your character, which you can never normally do. So if you scope in and then hit your analog stick, look at that boy, as I go from left to right, I actually want to see if I can throw that in a shot maybe. So here, here goes nothing. All right, so I'm going to go for that little combo on ground, jump off, pistol switch, and then, well, I shot off, I think, but um, that's the combo. I mean, I would do a tack knife flip, but you can't even see it in third person. It literally just looks like me pulling out my pistol like that, so fuck it. Just going to shoot my pistol in midair. Wish me luck here, boys. This one, um, ooh, that could actually hit, no lie. And I'm not using EB right now, by the way, guys. Here, let me pull up the menu to prove it. If I go to turn on aimbot range here in the toggle EB strength, see, it just put it on hit marker, which is like the first option, so I had no EB on. I'm going to turn it back off now. But I'm gonna be honest with you guys, if I can't hit it, I probably will use super close to try to hit something. Just because I do want to have a bunch of shots in this video showing off what you can do in third person. Just like this ACOG shot right here that I'm about to hit. Oh, I wish. It was actually on. There we go. Oh, that actually could have hit. That was the most on I've been yet. Wait, what if I do that midair? So do a little catwalk on ground. Not that you can even see it. Ooh, then switch like that. That could be cool. Hold on, what if I do one on ground? Then another midair. Oh, that was way off. But I might be cooking up here. Ooh, that could be it. Hold on, hold on. Wait. All right. Pistol swap. Ooh, okay, okay. I'm cooking up now. Do the scope thing. Pistol swap. Yeah, I'm gonna hit that. No lie. All right. On ground. Pistol swap. NSL. Oh, I didn't even get the pistol shoot off either way. But this will be dope if I hit it in kill cam, I think. I don't really know what a kill cam like this would look like. I just hit marked it. No way. I forgot to put it on minuscule because I thought I was going to be using like a little bit of EB. Not going to lie. I thought I was going to be using super close. So I didn't even bother putting it on minuscule and look what happened. Well, now that I hit the shot legit, I actually am going to put on super close EB so that I don't actually end up uh, hit marker in the shot again. But for the future games, I'm going to put on minuscule and I won't use super close unless I really need to. Like unless it's really taking a long time. And that should have hit first try, but okay. Need to get more ammo real quick. Watch me now not be able to hit this with EB. Wow, that was actually really close. I guess super close EB means like super close, huh? Oh, wait, I think I actually hit that for real, but I didn't get the pistol shoot. But look, it was a headshot, so I think I actually did. But let's see it in kill cam. Did a little glitch, pistol swap, 
Oh, does it really? Oh, wait, it does show. Okay, and I did hit it for real. But I failed the pistol shot, so I'm gonna hit one more shot real quick with EB with the pistol. I'm actually gonna turn up the EB even higher this time. I'm gonna do, um, instead of, yeah, I'm gonna do, well, I meant to do close, but fuck it. We're on medium, so we're gonna do medium. Alright, let's try, no matter what. Never mind. Boys, I'm not gonna lie, this is kind of highway robbery, the fact that this shot hasn't hit yet. Like that, dude. Actually, more like runway robbery. Get it? Because we're at an airport? No? Okay, unfunny joke. I get it. But this is the shot that's gonna hit. Wow. I feel like I say wow every time, but that's literally my genuine reaction. No, I actually hit the shot for real again, boys. I literally have aimbot right now when I hit market. That's how you know I hit for real. Alright, I'm turning it up one last time. Toggle EB strength. Normal. Okay, let's see what this does. There we go. That definitely did not hit, but I mean, I hit it like three times legit, so whatever. I'm just gonna take it to this point. Little, uh... POV glitch, or whatever you call it, pistol swap, and then another little, like, POV glitch midair. That could have hit, not really, kind of hit the wall behind him, but hey, close enough. Alright, time to get off this map. Oh yeah, I gotta do a slash disconnect, actually. And, um, what map are we gonna play next? I don't know yet. You know what, I feel like it could look weird or funny watching myself hitting a bounce in third person, so we're gonna do Afghan, because that's the easiest bounce to hit. Unlimited, unlimited, minuscule this time, and third person. Okay, let's get it. All right, boys, so I actually think I figured out a cool animation. You see, I have my sniper out right now, but when I pull out my AT4, it just appears out of nowhere. Like, my gun goes away for a second, then my intervention just appears on my back, and AT4. So I'm gonna try to hit that off the bounce. Wait, did I hit that bounce? I might have jumped, I don't even know, but I think I could have. All right, so I'm gonna spawn in a bot. I'm gonna go move him over there, because I want to hit it with a little bit of distance. Oh my god, the crosshairs are all off right now when you aim in. Save the crosshairs, put him right on the wall. Can I get it? Hey, there we go. I'm gonna save my position up here just like last time, and let's see if I can hit this. I'm gonna try with no EB to start off, but this one's kind of far, so I might end up throwing it on, but... Hey. Oh, that's what the bounce looks like. And I shot way off. Okay, good to know. That is not what you shoot. Wait, boys, I'm not gonna lie. This glitch is actually kind of weird to do off a of bounce. Oh, wait. Oh, I fucked it up. That looked funny, though, me running midair like that. Wait. I low-key do not have this down. Wait, I do... Oh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna need EB for this one, I'm thinking, but we'll see. All right, let's get it. Dude, that run midair looks so funny, and that actually could have hit, I think. Did I? Yeah, I shot right at him. Oh, I'd cry if I hit that with no EB, not gonna lie. Oh, I think I'm shooting on, too. Boys, this shot, like, if you're doing it in first person, probably would look trash. But, just because it's third person, um, I'm looking forward to seeing what it's gonna look like in kill cam. If I can even hit the bounce. There we go. Bounce, 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 run. Ooh, right over the top like that. All right. Back to back. Back to back good attempts. Oh, I'm going to hit that. All right. Bonds. Boing. And then boing. Oh, imagine. Boinging all over the place out here. Whoa, look how I just landed. I proned after, but like I was like proned laying up like that. It kind of looked like I was still standing. You guys probably don't even know what I'm talking about, but I promise I proned there. Wait, I wonder what a sea lion looks like. Like with a double stun throw. Here, let me go for that real quick. Hope I hit the bounce. There we go. Oh, it literally just looks like a double stun throw. Uninteresting. All right, boys. If I don't hit within the next three attempts, I think I'm going to throw on the super close CB because I've been going for this one for a little bit now. I probably cut out a lot of the boring parts, but just know I've gone for this a bunch and it should have hit. Like, dude, that one right there specifically should have hit. And third time's the charm. And if not, okay. Wait, wait. I didn't get to go for a try. Uh, one more. There we go. And then watch. Oh my god. I'm not even kidding, boys. I swear on everything. I swear on everything that that was not fake. That was no EB. I literally just called that out. I literally I have a full recording and everything. I can't even believe that just hit. No way. I lined it up and everything, but it kind of looked like EB. But I can show a full recording or everything if anyone doesn't believe that. That was as legit as it comes. Well, that was dope and highly unexpected, dude. I actually was going to throw on the EB and just hit that real quick. But I'm glad I hit it without EB. Makes the video even better. And now what map are we going to finish up on? Hmm. Alright boys, so the next map I actually think I'm going to do Scrapyard because I have something I want to hit on this map that I've never even hit in first person, never mind third person. And it's actually going to look pretty dope in third person, I think. So here, let me get on Scrapyard, start up the game. I'll show you guys what I'm going to go for next. Alright boys, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go over to the kill streak menu and get a bunch of care packages for this shot. And I'm actually going to try to hit a care pack stall, which I don't think I've ever even hit one on IW4X like in online. Never mind private match, like I just never go for these. I'm going to throw it right here. Try to get it to land on the roof and then hit a care pack stall off the roof, like jumping out of the window. I don't even have a bot in yet. I'm gonna try to get the care pack down first. First try luck. Imagine. 
Where did it even go? I don't I don't even know where it went. Did it even come in the map? I'm very confused. I don't even see it on the mini map. Um, maybe this try will help? You know what? I'm gonna throw two just for the fuck of it. One of them gotta work. Alright, let's see. Oh, it's looking better now. It's looking better. He's gonna drop the care pack and both of them and Oh, they're wait, what the? They're landing on the sky barrier. Uh okay, I guess I won't be going for a care package doll. That was my plan, but I don't know. I guess there's sky barriers on like this menu or something. That's not cool. I was actually pretty hyped to go for that, but whatever. Alright boys, so I got the bot there. I'm gonna teleport back up top and I actually think I'm gonna go for a ladder stall. I'm gonna attempt to at least if I can hit it in third person. Let's see. Oh, there we go. I actually almost hit the shot first try. A little sea lion action too. But I actually want to get a double stun throw on. Oh, yeah, that's the shot, boys. And stun myself after. Okay, I actually got it down already. Wait, I just realized if I stun myself, will I still get third eye and kill cam since I'm in third person? Nice, I shot off. I kind of wonder. I guess we'll try it out right here. <sighs> that was so on. Oh my god. All right, 360. This shot is literally only like uh kind of 5, 40, 7, 20, but I don't even care. It would look dope if I hit it. Nice, it stunned me even though I was up top. Let's get it. Can I get my stuns back, please? Please? Is it really not gonna give them back to me? What the it was literally giving back to me the whole time, and now it just decided not to. Uh how do I even get them back? Do I just go to like refill lethal equipment? Okay, that's not even a lethal equipment. Um, you know what? I think I'm just gonna kill him and start a new round then. And pause real quick so it goes through the menu quicker and through the kill cam. They added this to the menu. By they, I mean foxes. So if you accidentally like fuck up and kill last, you can just easily go to the next round. You don't have to wait through like the bullshit kill cam of you failing. But I right, boys, first try this round. Oh, never mind. I didn't even have the sea lion yet. It actually still could have hit though. But here, let me get the sea lion and let's hit the build cam. Oh, there it is. Damn it, I shot off. If I can get this third eye third person though, that kind of goes crazy. If, oh my god, I didn't want to stun myself there, but... I kind of did actually. Let's see what it looks like in kill cam. Never mind. I can't even hit the ladder. But once again, that stun managed to hit me. Boys, I've stunned myself more times than you could even possibly imagine. Like, you literally do not even get it. I've probably cut out a bunch of them, but like, it is getting bad actually. Please hit. That was right on, dude. If any shot would have hit, it would have been that one. But okay, whatever. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> oh, please. No. I actually didn't stun myself that time though. Went for the throw knife kill cam instead, and it actually, well, it went to the right of him, but that honestly seems more likely than the sniper kill cam right now. Does it just not give me stuns back after a while? No way that I have to keep, oh my god, can I get him from here? Nope, I actually think I have to kill him every time. Wow. You know what, temper shot onto the ladder? Wait, unless I go for a temper in third person. Ooh, temper ladder? That could actually be pretty dope. What if I do like a double temper? Yo, that is actually pretty dope. I kind of wanted to the stun ladder thing, but if I can hit this like that, never mind, I can't. Yo, okay, that will be fire if I hit it. Hold on. Dude. Silent shot? Yes and no. Probably not. I think, well, you can't even, like, tell if you reload or not. Oh, you can hear the reload, though. I don't know. But either way, this is literally going to hit. If I can hit the ladder, that is. What? I need to get more ammo real quick and then hit this other stall first try. Dude, imagine I called that. I'm literally gonna hit though, boys. Hold me to it. Yo, I hit the ladder high on that time too. Dude, I'm I'm I like I'm speechless. That's hitting. I swear on everything. Like I I don't even know what to say at this point. I give up. Okay, I don't actually give up. I really still do want to hit this. But if I don't hit soon and I keep shooting that on, I might need to throw on the super close CB, boys. As you've seen before, it doesn't actually help that much, though. Like, I can still shoot right next to him and it won't hit. It just, like, gives me a little bit of a boost. But if I'm shooting over there like I just did, it won't help literally at all. That literally hit. Okay, the EB is going on. I don't even care. I'm putting it on super close. There we go. I right, first try with EB. Watch this, boys. <laughs> Never mind, do not watch that. Actually, I hope you guys blinked when I did that. But this try... Okay, please, just close your eyes or something. Boys, I'm not gonna lie, since I put the EB on, I have not been able to hit this ladder properly. It is literally not looking good at all for me right now. Oh no, I'm literally doomed. Dude, please! Okay, I just need to... Just take a second. 
Line it up. Okay. Okay, I'm getting closer. Dude. There we... Never mind. I was going to say, there we go. I'm, I'm literally cursed, boys. I don't know. Should I quit trick shotting? Let me know in the comment section below. No, I'm kidding. <gasps> even went super close, dude. Aimbot literally doesn't even help. <laughs> it does not help when I'm shooting over there. That's for damn sure. Please, dude. I might need to even make it close. I don't think so, though. I think I can hit with super close. Can I, though? Can I? I don't know. I literally just... I need answers here. Please? No, come on. Dude, even with super close. Like, I know I say that every time, boys. I'm just, like, shocked that I have aimbot and that's not hitting. But I don't exactly know if he's in the middle of my crosshairs or anything. Since I am, as you guys can see, in third person. So who knows? Maybe I am shooting off on every one of these. But I don't know. They're looking pretty accurate to me. Except, you know what? I'm just... I didn't even say anything there. You guys didn't even hear that. Okay, boys, I'm literally having to turn it up to close. I'm sorry. I got to do what I got to do at this point. I've literally shot on so many times. You guys don't even know. And yep, that is when I know I got to turn it up. I just going on close. There we go. And let's hit this shit, boys. First try on close. Apparently not, but it wasn't even close, so I get it. And that one wasn't either, but at least I'm hitting the ladder now. Okay, that one was, I think, and it still didn't hit. There we go, finally, with the prone after two. That looked dope. I know, boys, I had to use aimbot, but I did hit the first two ones legit, and you guys literally don't even know how many times I went for that. I probably... Oh, that kind of looked cool. I was going to say I could have made it look cooler, but I actually really like how that looked in kill cam. Oh my god, I finally hit it. Thank the lord. Now we can finally get off this map. Slash disconnect. Thank the lord. Just like I just said. And yeah, that's going to be a wrap in today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And to anyone who's new to my channel, I hope you enjoyed the video enough to consider subscribing with post notifications on. If you guys are wondering on how you can stay more connected or up to date with me, I'm going to be leaving all my links down below in the description. That's going to include my Twitter, which I'm active on so much daily. So make sure to go follow me over there if you don't yet. My Discord, my Twitch, my second channel, my TikTok. I'm active on all of them pretty regularly. So if you do enjoy my content and want to stay connected, please make sure to go check them out and show some love. Oh yeah, one last thing. Anyone who's new to my channel that might want to know more about me personally and not just like my clips, I will be doing a Q&A soon for you guys over on Twitter, so make sure to go follow me over there, like I said, if you haven't yet. But if you just have a quick question you want a quick answer to, I do try to read every single message in my Twitch chat and reply to it. So if you ever see me live, come stop by my chat, ask a question, and I'll answer it to the best of my abilities. But yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow with another banger upload. Peace out, everyone. Parallel NECA out.